Okay, hello, this is Psychology A-Level. And what is psychology? So psychology is defined as the scientific study of behaviour and mental processes. Obviously, students haven't studied psychology before as it isn't offered as a GCSE in school, but they do usually find it fascinating as an A-Level subject. Structure of the course. Most important thing to note is that there is no coursework. So the A-level is entirely assessed by exams, three exams at the end of the two years. So paper one with various topics there, paper two and paper three, um, usually in, well, in year 13. OK, I'll give you some examples. So for example, memory. In paper one, there's a topic on memory which examines how memory works, why it is that we forget things. It, it also covers the real life issue of eyewitness testimony, like how to improve the testimony given by eyewitnesses. Paper two is research methods and biopsychology. Important to note that psychology is increasingly a biological science. So a lot of biopsychology, a lot of material about how the brain works, different functions of the brain and the nervous system. In year 13, we would do other topics, the topics for paper three, so things like issues and debates, forensic psychology, that's criminal psychology, and schizophrenia, gender. The exam board we use is the AQA board. So if you want to get more information, there's a lot of information about the course on their website there. Now then, because it's so much uh, an exam based course and the three exams are all at the end of the two years. It's really important that we do a lot of assessments, keep assessing students regularly. So they're very focused on, on that. So we do assessments after each topic, which is approximately each half term. We do short exam style questions, most lessons. Um, in some lessons we would do uh, a timed essay. Just noticed there's three L's there <laughs> to notice before. Um, and that's in addition to the general six form mock exam arrangements. And then you might want to know, might, you might consider how useful is psychology. Um, it is generally accepted as a useful A level for entry to a wide range of university courses. Because it's now accepted as a science, it's accepted as a um, for entry to medicine, dentistry, pharmacy, veterinary science, all health related courses and occupations. And future careers using psychology, loads of sites, loads of websites you can look on here, but Career Pilot is one of them, um, provides information on a wide range of career options. I mean, just as psychology is a useful A level for entry to different degree courses, so a psychology degree is useful for a range of different kinds of career options, as well obviously as specific careers in psychology, like clinical psychology, forensic psychology. Okay, I hope that was helpful. I hope that answered some of your questions about psychology A level. If you have any specific questions you want to email me, um, my name is Mrs Sullivan, and that's my, my email address there is bas at beckfootthornton.org. Okay, thank you.